Hi, welcome to the Hexmark Tavern. My name is Heather and I'm going to show you how to make a Pimm's Cup. Pimm's Cup dates back to the 1840s. Uh, it was first started by James Pimm's. He owned a uh, oyster bar in Poultry, England. And um, people would come in and just shoot down uh, shots of gin and they would, you know, pass out or it's not the greatest taste in my opinion, plain gin. Um, so he came up with this recipe where he um, cooked gin with herbs and um, fruit. And today we have Pimm's Cup number one. It tastes nothing like gin that you know. So what you do is you put in, this is our winter version, you put in um, a couple of slices of orange and lemon, take a muddler, muddle the fruit down, <clears throat> Get all the juice out. Then you uh, fill it with ice. Put in a shot and a half of pims. And then fill it with fresh local cider. You get ours from Breesland Orchards in Warren, Mass. And if you want to make it just a little bit lighter, give it a little shot of club soda. Take another piece of orange, use it as a garnish, and take a cinnamon stick for added flavor. The, the great thing about Pim's Cup is every um, piece of fruit and or vegetable that you put in here, you will actually be able to taste each and every piece of fruit. Okay, now that I made my Pim's Cup, what goes better with Pim's Cup than fresh ocean oysters from Duxbury, Mass. Take a little fresh lemon, squirt it on, a little cocktail sauce, slide it right down. Mm. That's excellent.